At your home building center starting gate in motion here for race number six for Red Shores and Charlottetown tonight. Back upstairs to track announcer Vance Cameron for the race call. Woodmere Alvin, Silver Hill Lightning, Lord and Legend, Victonian Thunder, Usurper. The big chase, it's the six, top of the stretch. Sixth race approaching a start. Rough and pacing, Lord and Legend, Woodmere, Alvin, Usurper, way wide the big chase, then Silver Hill Lightning, and Pictonian Thunder will trail, and off stride, Lord and Legend self-destructed on the first turn. Driving up on the outside is Usurper headed to the lead, in line to Brody McPhee. Woodmere, Alvin is second, Silver Hill Lightning third, the big chase, he drops in fourth, that's Pictonian Thunder fifth, and at the back after the break, Lord and Legend, they arrive at the opening quarter. Usurper getting them there. Racing from second is Woodmere Alvin around the turn. Silver Hill Lightning third, the quarter in 29 and one. Fourth, the big chase. Pictonian Thunder in fifth, trailing the field. That's Lord and Legend. They straighten through the stretch. They have the half mile in their sights now. Usurper will get them halfway home. Woodmere Alvin on his back in the two hole. Racing from third, Silver Hill Lightning. The big chase continues fourth. Pictonian Thunder in fifth. Lord and Legend six. 58 and three for an opening half mile. That was 29 and two in the second split. Over to the 5 8. Usurper the leader. Woodmere Alvin is second on the outside. The big chase takes over third. Silver Hill Lightning along the rail. Fourth on the outside. Fifth, Pictonian Thunder. Lord and Legend, the trailer, three quarters next. Usurper arriving there with the lead. Getting that two-hole ride, Woodmere Alvin. The big chase dropped in third. Up fourth on the outside, Pictonian Thunder. Three quarters in one, 28 flat. They're homeward bound now. Usurper widening the lead. Woodmere Alvin is second, the big chase. Pictonian Thunder way wide, deep in the stretch. Here's Usurper for Brody McPhee. Pictonian Thunder up second. Woodmere Alvin held on to third. Time for the mile, 156 2 Well, we talked about it in the pre-race, uh, just how good this combination is, Brody and Usurper. Uh, they got it done last week, different tactics. Brody sat at the back and flew home late to win it well. He put him on the point here tonight, and he meant business right off the wings here tonight. 29-1, and one, he was over there and very, very comfortable as the boss. 58-3, and three, Brody got him to the half, still the boss, 128. He is still controlling up past three quarters, and really, it was all over when they swung for home. Brody very comfortable here in the bike, just keeping his mind on business here but boy he looked good on the front end here tonight and really no challenges throughout the mile Brody and this guy get along great 156 and 2 right to the point and he was a winner all the way here tonight in the sixth we'll see usurper and Brody in the winner's circle next
Here comes Usurper into the sixth race winner's circle. Bay Pacing Stallion 4 by Sports Rider off the McCardle Dam, Lulu Q. Over the next generation stable Stratford, trained by Earl Smith, Brody McPhee in the driver's seat for the win. Horse picks up his fifth lifetime victory tonight, 156 and 2. Usurper in the sixth. 